bought these rounds at Bass Pro Shop, and uh, I guess a couple of rounds got past quality control because if you zoom in, if you look here where the where I have this pointer, this is this the casing was the casing was loose from uh, the bullet, and both of the, these two rounds <coughs> when you roll them out they uh they wobble which means that they're not uh <coughs> that they're out of uh out of out of centricity if you look at the top of the heads you can see they're out of centricity see how they wobble they shouldn't they shouldn't move 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 smoother like that if they were balanced and and centered and uh went to rack it <coughs> charged use the charging handle to charge these uh, unfortunately were the first two rounds that uh that were in my magazine and uh, this foul up caused it to uh to double feed because it, it wouldn't slide into the wouldn't slide into the inside of the bore because of uh, being oblonged and causing it to jam. And I'm glad there wasn't a bear there when I had to go outside and look for look at something. But just want to let everybody know to always check your uh, rounds before loading for these kind of issues, whether it be they're not uh, uh, crimped correctly uh, in, into the casing or or the projectile, which is the bullet being loose. So I'll let everybody know because <laughs> you want to be up against a threat and have this type of issue happen to you. I'm going to contact the, ma the manufacturer and see if uh, I can get some kind of a discount due to the, due to the malfunction of the, of the first two rounds. James Eager was right. Always check your uh, stuff. And subsequently I just watched a video on YouTube from James Yeager on making sure you always check your stuff. Because he showed a picture of a dented up casing. And ironically, this happened to me right after I uh, saw the picture on online. So make sure you check everything.